Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Etrian Odyssey with me, Ornery Mook. Uh, last time, uh, as you can see, uh, we actually were over to the west, where that chop block is, where I'm, my arrow is pointing. Uh, if you want to take a look at the map, I've actually filled in, uh, or at least put walls around everything that we had before, so it looks a little bit neater. Uh, right now, I'm actually getting ready to head up and turn this quest in, so let's go ahead and get to that. Alright, report results. Yeah! We've received word from our soldier that you've completed your map. Well done! We acknowledge and recognize your status as true explorers from this point on. You belong to the Triumph Guild, correct? Let me give you the standard reward. Take this to Shalika's goods. She'll sell you, she'll sell you items necessary for your adventures. Stock up there and work hard to explore the labyrinth for us from here on out. Obtain Rada Note. Uh, we got 500 bucks. Woohoo! Love me some money. Alright, well, uh, as you can see here from the party, uh, it was a little bit hairy getting out of there. Uh, I didn't think Maya was going to make it for a little while, but we managed to get out, and that's the important thing. So let's over to, head over to Shellica's place. Uh, I guess we talked to her. We did get permission from the Rana. Here you go. Oh, it's okay. We understand. Oh, warp wire. This is great. Yes, it is a very handy tool. Alright, so now we can actually, I guess, buy stuff from her, including warp wire, which I will buy. Uh, typically, I like to carry three. That may seem a little bit excessive, but... There are times whenever you forget to buy them here and there, and it's just handy to have them on hand. Um, but anywho, let's uh, let's go ahead and sell everything that we collected so far, all the nifty swag, and see what, if anything, we can make. Nothing? Oh, we can make a hide ring. Okay. Uh, bug wings, we have a couple of those. Small fangs, we have several of those. We can make a dagger. Alright. Beast Bone, we can sell those up. We can make a Bone Staff. White Stone, we can sell off. Uh, it didn't give us anything. So it didn't look like we got a whole heck of a lot for what we turned in, but then again, we didn't turn in a crazy amount. Um, honestly, the Hide Ring doesn't look all that great. I mean, the Slash Resist is, I guess, okay, but eh, not for that kind of money right now. Let's see here. Um, you know what else I could probably do is let me check what everyone else is wearing. You could use a leaf boot. Uh, you already have both. You already have a leaf boot. You could use a leaf boot. You have one. Okay, so let me try and remember this here. So I think we need two leaf boots. I think that should do it. I think Lorelei needs one. There we go. And I think we can give one to Gibbs. And that ought to speed him up a little bit in combat. Every little bit helps when you're the healer. And let's see here. You're full. You could probably use something else. You could use something else. And I could use something else. Uh, we could probably get that glove. I don't see why not. Alright, that's good. Let's see here. Good. Oops. All right. Well, now that we've taken care of that, Go ahead and check out the pub. Ahoy, kiddos. We're newly lessons ventures. Yep, we are from the Rada. 
No, well, that's us. That's our forte. Well, lay it on us, sister. We will do our best. All right. Okay. Hmm. Soft hide. We can get some of that, and it has money. Money is always good. Uh, artisan. Okay. Okay. Artisan supplies are running low. No. Oh. Well, that should be simple enough. Ah. Okay. This one I know it is. X Explorer. Holy water. I bet you I know exactly where that is. Yep. I think we were there several times. Well, we'll do our best. Let's see. And then a favor for Shalika. Hmm. Yep. Okay. Her grandfather ran the place. Hmm. I think we could help her out. Alright. Well, with all that out of the way... What do we need for this hand axe, Miss Shellica? Yep. Five pieces of hardwood and five hard shells. Okay. Okay. Well, I think we could manage that. Alright, in the meantime, let us go to the inn. I've, uh... Well, we might as well sleep. Because we are kind of... Oh, one hour? and That's amazing. I'll tell you what, actually, I'm going to nap again. Just to kick it back over to night time. Because we're going to need that for the one quest. And then we might as well save it here. Alright. Okay. Well, let's head back into the forest, and we will see what we can do about at least one or maybe two of these quests before time runs out. Alright. So, to do this, we will go ahead and use our handy-dandy shortcut. I love that thing. I was wondering when that was going to kick in. Alright, wood flies. Have some of that. Ha ha ha. Alright. Doing good so far. Get him, Gibbs. Gibbs is on a roll. He has not taken any prisoners today. Okay, let's see here. As you walk the narrow path, you see glistening water flowing from between the rocks. Alright, let's check that. You reach out to the water to draw from the source. Obtained holy water! Huzzah! Alright, well, that's one quest down. More wood flies. Ow, that was a good one. Uh-oh, Gibbs' head has been sealed. And I think that means he can't heal, but hopefully if I can take this thing down quick, it shouldn't matter. There we go. Alright. Yeah, we haven't been up here yet. We might as well go explore this and see what all is what. Wood flies. Oi. Nice one, voltage. All right. XP for everyone. And it looks like this goes up here. 
and then just kind of turns around, make turns a corner there. So we'll just go ahead and mark that, and then we'll see what's here. And it looks like it just kind of does one of these. There we go. Oh, we have goodies. I like goodies. I can't think of a single person who doesn't like goodies. And it's a mole. Man, those things hit pretty hard. Okay, let's see here. Oops. I'll seal the two of them up so that way they can take a bit more of a beating. As you continue into the forest, you reach a clearing. Squarish boxes are lined up before you. It's possible they were left by fellow adventurers of the labyrinth, or fellow explorers. Then, too, they may be part of the treasure room which litter the labyrinth. The boxes sit ready to be opened, offering no clues to their nature. All right, well, let's have Adam. A large box stands before you. Open it. Heck yes. We got a Medica, too. We got another sword that we already have two of and don't really need any more of. And we got 200 bucks. Not a bad haul all in all, I'd say. Alright, so we got this. And we will mark these. Oop, just to denote that we found them. And then we will just, I guess, paint this in. Because that's what good map makers do. Oh, whoops. Wow, I messed that up. There we go. Alright. A mole and a wood fly. And I think we can take these pretty easily now. Alright. They're still hitting about the same amount of damage, but it's not really hurting me as badly. Alright, we got a beast bone. I can live with that. Oop. There we go. Now we'll just connect that. Connect that. And then fill that in. Alright, so we have that mapped. Now we know what's up there. And actually, just to denote that I've gotten all the goodie, although you can't really see it, uh, I'm just going to paint those in. Um, even though, you know, it's like it's it's kind of hard to see behind that graphic. But uh, oh boy, more wood flies! Man, this, they just have are uh, having a wood fly bonanza. I swear. I'm trying to find these moles, but. They're not really popping up, and when they are, they're not really dropping that skin that we need. Really? Well, I'll tell you what, oh, we've got a bug wing and a tiny petal. I'll tell you what, uh, we are actually just about out of time, so what, I will, what I'll see if I can do for next time is I'll see if I can do some mole hunting and come up with some skins. So until then, uh, this is Let's Play Train Odyssey with me, Ornery Mook. Thanks for coming along, folks. It's always good to have you. Feel free to stop by. In the meantime, have a good one and catch you later.